For all the accolades, all the records, and all the wins that followed because of them, Fordham legend Ann Gregory is most proud of one stat, her career rebounds. It's not surprising that the ultimate hustle stat defines arguably Fordham's greatest basketball player. For every rebound she pulled down off the boards, Ann Gregory O'Connell opened the doors for women in the game of basketball. The rebounding does stand out because it's such a, a funny number. You know, it's one short of 2,000, and the way that that happened was was comical. I fouled out of the game. My teammates were throwing the balls up against the backboard so I could get a rebound, trying so hard. I ended up fouling out. It makes a great story. The first game I ever did was a, was a Fordham women's game. And everybody said, oh, where do you see this girl Gregory? Where do you see her play? Then she comes out on the court and it was like, wow. I mean, the, the, the passion and intensity, she just played so hard. And to have her record stand, 30 years after she's out just shows you uh, the kind of commitment she had. And Gregory O'Connell starred for the Rams from 1976 through 1980, leading the program to a 91 and 36 record, its greatest four year span in team history. She was very unselfish. He had great hands, great rebounder, good passer, and she just, you know, wasn't intimidated by anybody. Most of the team is here 30 years later. And uh, that, that's what a team's all about. And, and these girls certainly were a team. You might find players who played as hard as Ann Gregory, but you will never find a player who played harder. Ann Gregory's husband, college basketball Hall of Fame sports writer Jim O'Connell, put her place into hoops history into perspective. When she was a freshman, uh, she played a game in an AIAW tournament at St. John, and she had 36, 32 right? points, okay. 36 rebounds. Yes. At Alumni Hall with Coach Carnesecca, and they announced that Annie had just broken Mel Davis's Alumni Hall rebounding record. And Coach said, no woman's holding the rebounding record in this place. So when we got married, Coach was at the reception. I brought him over to Annie, and I said, hey, Coach, tell Annie what you said when she got her uh, 25th rebound. Oh, I said she was a great player. I said that's, you know. <laughs> For the Gregory O'Connell family, basketball in Fordham is a tradition. Until this year, I never knew like the impact that she and especially her teammates. I mean, they were 91 and 36 in four years. I mean, when you do that now, so we kill for 91 and 36 right here. So it really speaks to the history of the program. Anybody who knows me knows how proud I am to be from the Bronx. Parkchester was a fabulous place to grow up. In honor of the first female inducted into the Fordham Hall of Fame and the first to have her number retired, the Rams honored Gregory O'Connell the same way she honored playing for the Maroon and White with a win. When the banner drops and you see that and you know that you're forever etched in the history, this really great history of Fordham, how did that feeling feel? It's, it's so hard to say. It's like I got all welled up inside. I, I just didn't really know how to, like I said, I, I said, it's the coolest thing that's ever happened to me.